am a very big believer in purpose and most people when they ask me what is your purpose i usually reply that i have uh, this dream or this purpose of inspiring people to wake up every morning understanding that there is something they need to do to change the world to change their society to make people's life around them to be much much better when people wake up every morning they have this sense of responsibility that i am going out today to make an impact in the life of somebody or to make an impact in the society not just that i'm going to make money okay and that is one thing i believe so much and uh in the past few decades we've seen that there is a whole lot of revolution in the way people actually see life now that it's not just about making money but you need to actually attach yourself to a purpose to be there at the top okay and not just at the top like financially but at the top in whatever you're passionate about so i just want to talk about the golden circle it's something described by simon sinek in one of his ted talks uh, start with why the golden circle has uh, three circles the innermost circle the outer circle and the outermost circle and uh, each of them represents something the innermost circle represents why the outermost uh, the outer one represents how and the outermost one represents uh, what and we get to this level in our lives where we begin to question everything that happens like i've spoken often that uh, from my high school i really began to question a lot of things and though it cost me lots of things like academically because i lost interest in education and all this stuff because i was really trying to figure out what am i living for what am i doing what am i doing with my life Okay, that was like I was still around 14, 15 years old. So people actually get to this level where they begin to question everything, question the status quo, question what they are doing with their life. And everyone begins to call them weird. And even them, they think they are weird. But you are not completely weird, okay, like as bad as you think. There are two kinds of weird. There are the negatively weird people and there are the positively weird people. So there are people who are weird in the sense that they, they spoil everything that comes around them. They make a very negative uh, influence in the society. But your own weirdness is the one that actually gears towards some really good impact in your society, in your family, around your friends or whoever. So one of the things you should really begin to do now is when you find out you have started questioning stuff, when you find out that things are no longer making sense, the usual way everybody accepts it, okay? Like the usual status quo that is accepted by everyone. Now what you need to do is begin to find out how those things that you are questioning came into existence. Now you move to the outer circle. That is the question of how. You begin to ask how did these things come to be and how can we actually make them to become better? Okay, the why actually defines the purpose of the stuff. But for you to actually make something different, you need to move on to the how. How does it work? How did we come to this stage? How did we get to this stage? And how can I actually improve stuff to make it much better to people around me, to people in different kind of societies, okay? So we create that kind of enthusiasm to know how this stuff works. And then uh, when you understand how it works and you try to develop how you can actually make it better most of the inspirational speakers they tell you follow your heart and take action so you need to stick and believe in that how the newly found way that you have thought that is going to work and now move on to what you going what you're going to do okay so what are you going to do what are you what action are you going to take to actually make it possible the problem is many people they have lots of ideas they have lots of understanding of how stuff works and and why those things work like that but they fail to take action don't be that person who doesn't take take action so whether you have found your papers you are on the path to finding it or you just started or you just started finding out that you're questioning everything now you need to move on to the next levels and everything takes time okay so whatever level you are always have the golden circle in your mind ask the questions of why how and what you can do to make things better and in that way you find yourself becoming the best version of yourself and bringing out the best version in everyone around you